I'm just, yeah, I'm doing this performance here because I feel like it's a marginalized part of like history, untold history that I, that I wanted to revisit because it really reflects our current state right now. I mean, think... were you here during the LA riots? No, I wasn't. Yeah, well, neither was I, but I know that, you know, I was doing a lot of research and like, I was just a kid. Somehow the Koreans were taking this blame for, you know, all like sort of the racial tensions go, you know, happening. Yeah, well, and I just... the woman shot, I mean, didn't she shot the 15 year old girl in the back? That's not what my piece is about. I'm trying to explore that, that the media sort of took that footage and kind of they're manipulating the people to kind of sort of misdirect like all the the real issues i feel like if we had real dialogue and if we could really talk about these issues we would know that we're like actually <laughs> connected and that we all want peace okay well i hear you talking and this is not a dialogue because you're do you're doing all the talking and i'm just if you want to have a proper dialogue i want to talk to you about this because i find you so interesting and you've been here but I feel like you're talking at me. You're not listening to me. Yeah. So sorry. I just. It's okay. I'm sorry. I just. You know, we had that thing, and and then I've had like some other like friends of mine who are very dear friends, like you know, attack you know, attack me and say that it was like kind of like anti-black and blackness. And, and are you anti-black? No, of course not. <laughs> okay, good. Of course, are you I'm... kidding? Like my best friends are like, yeah, like whatever. I mean, no.